I'm a little bit lost. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, this is the target today to uh, test this uh, Canon EF2405 ISL USM lens uh, on, a, on a Sony A7 Mark I with a 7 Artisans EF SE adapter. And, um, it's been pretty promising. I've been using it a little bit in the garden at home, but uh, now for some real shooting. <laughs> Got it used for about 350 uh, euros here in Norway. Um, and it seems to be in very good nick. So um, let's uh, try and use it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so uh, I got this uh, very nice reflection in the water and uh, <laughs> it's kind of boring, but I'll shoot it anyway. Uh, it's, the sky is blue <laughs> and uh, no clouds, but I got this very still water and this reflection and I have to shoot it quickly before the waves come in. So the uh, the autofocus seems to be very responsive with this lens, even with this adapter, and uh, so that's all all good. Let's just shoot a couple of more different exposures, and as usual, I'm fucking it up. I'm messing it up by adjusting the uh, aperture instead of the shutter speed. Yeah, so uh, but, uh, I think I'll, I should hunt for a better uh, composition <laughs> because with this guy today I think it's, all, it's going to be all about composition and if I'm lucky um, maybe I can uh, get some ducks to uh, model for me <laughs> as a uh, one, two, three, four mallard ducks doing their duck things out on the lake here so should have some duck food and uh, get them closer but <laughs> I don't have food for myself even so uh, so that's uh, <laughs> that's a <the> thing <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah let's move Uh, maybe. 
maybe <laughs> maybe I have something here maybe 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 so Shorten the legs on this because I want to get lower down. Probably scared of yeah, all the ducks are on the other side of the lake. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, humans, we're making too much noise. Well, I am. Let's conjure up a, some sort of a composition here. Now, this is a high contrast scene. This is a very high contrast. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm starting to get some clouds, so maybe this won't be so bad after all. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm just gonna film this, and uh, so you'll see what I see. Yeah, so this is what I'm seeing. Um, and uh, approximately <laughs> and uh, yeah I got this little rock with some uh, moss on it and these uh, uh, spruce trees fucking hate spruce uh, and uh, with some dead stuff in the foreground uh, and um, this nice reflection, maybe if I, but, uh, yeah, something like that, but uh, maybe I should exposure bracket that rock and, uh, and see what I can make of it. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, so let's do that. <laughs> <laughs> so, what I'm going to attempt is to exposure bracket it and also uh, also uh, yeah, let's see <laughs> I, I lose my words sometimes uh, it's hard speaking English uh, I'm, uh, I'm finding the words sometimes. So, well. <sighs> yeah. I forgot to focus. <laughs> yeah. So that's first exposed for the background. And then expose, and then focus. So I'm going to focus bracket as well. That's 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 what I was looking for. I'm going to expose exposure bracket and focus bracket this one. So just to make it extra complicated for myself. That ought to do it. So, uh, so what does that mean? Yeah, um, basically I'm going to take two shots. Uh, one where I'm focusing on the background, the trees. And one where I'm focusing on the rock. And for the focus on the... 
there's two ducks two meters in front of me Okay, <laughs> wasn't ready for that. <laughs> uh, yeah, back to uh, <laughs> they're gone. Okay, back to my explanation. <laughs> so I'm I'm uh, focusing focus bracketing those trees and that rock, and then I'm exposure bracketing the same. Uh, so I'm just gonna take one picture of the trees, uh, focusing on that and exposing for it, and one with the uh, rock and uh, and, uh, and uh, with another exposure, uh, and uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna hope because I haven't got a flying clue what I'm doing. So. Uh, <laughs> So uh, I'm just going to take the shots and uh, see what I can make of them when I come home uh, editing. First focus on the trees. Yeah, it's finding focus. This lens is finding focus uh, immediately. And, uh, and uh, I'm happy. Even on a 14 year old camera with, a, with, a, with an adapter, uh, it works. So, yeah, one thing. I'm just gonna take this off. <laughs> it's on a tripod, so I need to switch off the stable laser. So, <laughs> there. Yeah, should be okay. So, that was the uh, exposure and focus on the trees. And uh, now we are going to uh, shift the focus to the to the rock. And focus. Yeah. And do a different exposure there. And Okay, onwards to uh, new adventures. <laughs> so, oh. maybe get the lens cap on in case I mess up. So. Yeah. So, autofocus works very well. Um, with the, the seven artisans uh, and uh, and uh, also image stabilization works kind of <laughs> uh, in uh, manual mode uh, I have to do a workaround on it it's uh, uh, it focuses and when you take the shot then the image stabilization works so I have uh, I have uh, uh, focus on on that. Yeah, yeah I have uh, back button focus, and uh, I'm using it all the time I need it, and um, and that won't activate the uh, back button focus. But when I uh, press the 
the trigger button. Uh, take the shot. Then the uh, the uh, IS comes on, and if if I keep the uh, image stabilization pressed, then I can <laughs> use the image stabilization. In aperture priority, it works very well. Uh, works as intended, so uh, so that's good. Uh, and I don't need the image stabilization when it's on a tripod, and I probably shoot about 90% of my photography on the tripod. Uh, what's important is that uh, the autofocus works, and it does. As far as I can tell, it's working very nicely in both uh, AFC and single shot. And I mostly use single shot. Uh, and uh, yeah, like for all the, the things that I use it for. It also works in uh, when I'm filming. <laughs> and included in uh, AFC uh, mode. So, uh, so there's really no big problems about using this, uh, this adapter and uh, it's about half the price of the uh, of the uh, sigma mc11 or yeah so uh well worth uh, the money and uh, yeah i bought both the lens and this for my own money <laughs> so uh, i'm not sponsored by canon <laughs> with uh, 37 views on my last video <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, and uh, not by seven artisans uh, so uh, they made me wait a, a good while for this uh, adapter though so maybe they should send me some compensation for that <laughs> uh, yeah so uh, but uh, let's move on Maybe we can uh, scare up some more ducks. <laughs> yeah. Horst 1907 Vannverk Ja, det translates til Horst Waterworks 1907 My guess is that that's when this dam was built Let's move around and see what we can do to get around this spruce forest Watch out for the trees. <laughs> yeah, I'm on the opposite side of the lake now. So, uh, it's actually quite nice. But, uh, Boring. <laughs> it's a beautiful, beautiful place, but uh, there's no, there's this harsh light. It, it's seven o'clock in the morning, and uh, to to uh, to get the, the light now, <laughs> you have to be here at midnight. <laughs> but uh, I wanted to last night, but I was so tired, so. Uh, I ended up falling asleep on the sofa, woke up at 6 in the morning and uh, drove my wife to work and, uh, and I went straight here and uh, yeah, it's nice for a morning walk <laughs> or a jog, but, uh, a little bit boring for photography but uh, <sighs> I just have to find 
something and uh, it doesn't have to involve that blueness. I hope I'm not mumbling too much. What the hell is that noise? Yeah, I hope I'm not mumbling too much because uh, it's just a habit. I, ha I have big problems raising my voice in the woods to uh, American levels. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, um, uh, it's something to do with uh, respect for nature. You, you don't, in Norway, you don't make a lot of noise when you're out in, uh, in nature. And uh, I got flying ducks again, right in front of me. Flying straight for me and, and I'm not ready. Yeah, it's landing. I could have done that with a 200 millimeter, but uh, Let's get it out then, get some duck food. I've switched back to the 24-7 and moving on. I'm hungry uh, and uh, while the lake is beautiful, I'll come back here with breakfast someday <laughs> and, and stay longer, but I'm, uh, I'm famished. I haven't eaten since 8 o'clock yesterday and it's now 8 o'clock in the morning. Uh, yeah. So uh, I think I'll just move on, keep this one handy. If I see something on the way back to uh, the park up and um, see if I can scrounge up some breakfast somewhere. And uh, there's a flying duck in front of me again. Yeah, so uh, Let's uh, let's just go. <laughs> so I got this. Mm -hmm. 